Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to see the catheterization technique in cats as uh, male cats are more prone uh, to urinary obstructions. Uh, so uh, this is a similar case that arrived at our clinic uh, with the same issue and uh, we will place a catheter in it as this cat has not uh, been urinating for about uh, three or four days and um, as you can see in the picture that uh, we will pass the catheter from the penis uh, through the urethra down uh, to the urinary bladder uh, if there is some obstruction in the urethra so uh, our catheter would not pass uh, but um, in that case uh, we were uh, able to pass the catheter uh, down to the urinary bladder quite easily so that it means that there is no obstruction in the urethra there may be some obstruction in the urinary bladder that uh, could be because of um, stones or maybe some blood clots as you can see in the video that we are gently passing it uh, down to the bladder uh, the, these uh, catheters are actually uh, of some uh, exact size of some average size of the urethra so uh, when it passes completely it means that uh, it is in the bladder and uh, the urine would drip out uh, from this catheter if it's not dripping out you can use a syringe and uh, suck it from the bladder and uh, we will empty out that uh, bladder as much as we can uh, for this purpose uh, we could also use um, uh, lidocaine mixed with normal saline solution and uh, uh, as you can see here that we are injecting this lidocaine mixed uh, normal saline uh, in the bladder so that we can flush it more efficiently and extract out all the urine uh, this urine is actually mixed with uh, a lot of blood uh, it confirms that uh, there is uh, some infection in the bladder as well and that could be of uh, some, because of some bacteria and we have also placed some pressure on the uh, bladder from the outside uh, for proper emptying of the bladder and after that we will place uh, uh, some sutures and we will place that catheter uh, on the prepuce with the help of uh, silk braided sutures uh, so that the uh, the pathway remains unblocked for a few days and the cat could pass urine easily and um, as you can see that uh, we have placed one suture on the four o'clock and uh, the other will be on the eight o'clock uh, it uh, makes some grip and uh, the catheter won't move out And we will also place a neck collar on this cat uh, so that it won't bite and uh, remove that catheter like uh, it's it's uh, quite disturbing for the cats and they usually uh, tear it out like it's quite disturbing for the cats and they usually uh, remove it uh, with the help of their teeth and uh, so that's why we will also place a collar and uh, for strength we have placed these sutures and uh, now this uh, catheter is fixed there in place and it will stay there for a while and we will also go for some other uh, medications uh, for example fluid therapy and uh, other treatment as well and we will also recommend a proper diet uh, for this cat so that uh, uh, we could overcome uh, this uh, inflammation and this urinary obstruction issue uh, thank you so much for watching my video and stay tuned for some more videos if you want some specific kind of videos please let me know in the comment section thank you